My friends, this is Alvaro with the channel Uniquely Mary, and right now I'm doing a series on the Beatitudes. But sometimes in the midst of certain things, you have to stop and speak about other things. And I think now is such a time. So about 105 years ago, right around this time, was a few days before the Blessed Mother appeared to three children at Fatima. Many of you are very familiar with this. And the context of some of the things that were going on was that an angel had been appearing to them previously teaching them different prayers. One of the reasons why he taught them those prayers were because of sacrileges that were being committed against the Eucharist. You all know that prayer to the Most Holy Trinity where you're offering the Eucharist and it's a reparation prayer because the atheistic government that was coming into power in Portugal was committing crimes and sins against the Eucharist. We are there again. If you think about that time 105 years ago, lots of things were stirring. That, the coming Russian Revolution that was happening and continuing to happen, World War II, the apparition of Fatima. So those were signs that something big was about to happen. When I looked at the news and heard of all these crazy things, that tells me something huge is about to happen and is already happening. Throughout the country, many churches are being desecrated and looted against and things like that. Here where I am in Houston, a church had a whole tabernacle stolen from it, and most certainly that Eucharist was desecrated and burned as they said that they would. So we're here and it's real and it's happening. So we need to be warned and take notice and ask ourselves, what are we going to do? The way that I see it, I think that both the clergy and the lady, I think were cowards, to be frank. And a question is, well, are we? What do you think? What are we gonna do? Because if we're not as zealous for Jesus as the evil people are zealous for evil, then we're never going to defeat evil. They are more zealous for evil than we are for Jesus. Now that's a problem. We need to ask ourselves, what are we going to do? There are many good Catholic sources out there giving ideas, but what are you gonna do? You need to ask yourself that question, what am I gonna do in the United States if you live here or in your respective countries? And are we ready for the big things that are about to happen? I would say most of us are not. That's the reason why I'm doing the series on the Beatitudes because they each prepare you basically to be a martyr. Martyrdom is coming. And when it's knocking on your door, remember that I told you, because that's what's about to happen. So we've seen it coming and it's now here. What are you going to do? We may not have power over the government. We may not have power of the opinions of our elected leaders, priests, bishops, or the Pope. But 105 years ago, God sent an angel to these three children and through their prayers and sacrifices, look at what they did. So don't say, that you can't do anything. What are you gonna do? He gave them a powerful prayer of reparation. Maybe all that you're called to do is to pray that often. Now is the time to prepare. Now is the time of reparation. I'm telling you, something big is on the horizon. It's been coming a long time and here it is. Don't waste your time being afraid. Spend your time getting ready. My friends, God bless you. I'll see you in the next video.